Well, hello, welcome to my channel, Premier Iowa Tree Surgeon. This is Jay. So today, I'm doing a full video on my new firewood conveyor I went and picked up Saturday. I was able to get this conveyor uh, at a Purple Wave auction. I actually got two conveyors for about, it was a little over $800. Then I had to go pick them up. With the other conveyor, it's a flat conveyor. I don't know if I'm just going to sell it or re-auction it off. But, to be determined. So this conveyor don't have any brand manufacturing name on it anywhere. So I'm not sure what kind it is. But it seems to be working fairly well. There's a few kinks I need to work out. So I hope you stick around and watch till the end. I'm at 949 subscribers. I'm trying to get to 1,000. So when I get to 1,000, we're going to be doing a giveaway of some sort. I got to figure out what I'm going to give away. But... I hope uh, you stick around to the end and subscribe to my channel so you can help me reach that thousand goal subscriber and we can give a giveaway.
I have my ST31 Wacker Deuce and Skid Loader. 74 horse. Prime attachments. It's an 8 foot snow slash material bucket. I got this for snow. Also, when I do tree work to clean up, uh, to haul, look, like look at this. I think it's 39 inches tall. No, 39 inches deep and 36 inches tall. It could easily fit two rows of 16 inch cut firewood. Uh, I could stack that, so much firewood in there. Probably a, at least a face cord can fit in this bucket. So let's get her up to the wood splitter and get this split. So this is my idea. So I can just have these logs right there. I can turn around and grab them one by one. And then we got the conveyor I just picked up on Saturday. I got this at an auction back in December. I got this one and another one. I got both of them for 800 bucks. This is the primary, the one I wanted. I need to have some legs made for it because right now, I just got them on uh, two 16 inch chunks of cherry, which is giving me plenty enough height for my baskets. So if you notice, I got this at Purple Wave Auction. There's no manufacturer name on the conveyor, so. So in order to turn this on, you just push this little button up. It's not fast, but I think it's perfect. The only thing I can see is maybe cutting this metal here and make it more of an incline so any wood that would hit here would slide into the tray, the same with the back. But for now, it's working perfect. So let's get this Wolfridge splitter fired up. I got her choked. We just turned the key here. We'll let it warm up for a few minutes. I did get the bucket a little too close. But the conveyor is nice and quiet. I mean, this is the motor end. I don't think it's loud at all. When I first got it home, before I greased it, and then I sprayed all these joints with uh, some WD-40. We got uh, grease zerks. So you see there's a grease zerk there. There's this grease zerk in there. So this is March. 4th or 5th and I can't see right now because I got so much sweat dripping in my eyes.
the conveyor worked pretty well. I can see I got a couple kinks to work out uh, at the top. There's a place where the wood can get bunched up, but that's a really easy fix just to put some kind of a angle up there so it would redirect the wood away from the, the side of that rail or cut the that piece off and bend it and weld it back to where it's pushing the wood so it don't hit that square tube at the end. Uh, made that tote of firewood pretty quick. I, I got some kinks to work out with it, but uh, thanks for sticking around to the end. If you like these kind of videos, I'd appreciate it if you would like, comment, share them with your friends, and consider subscribing to my channel. I'd appreciate it. Have a great day.